Come along with us as we take a hot air balloon ride over Sedona, Arizona. This is a new adventure for all of us. Sit back and join us as we take flight. Here we are around 4.10 in the morning in Sedona, Arizona. And as you can see on the sign, it says Red Rock Balloon Adventures. That's what we're getting ready to do. We're getting ready to take a hot air balloon ride over Sedona this morning to see the sunrise. This should be fun. Good morning. You can see everybody's here. They're wide awake, excited to take their balloon ride. Are y'all excited for the balloon ride? Yeah. Y'all don't excited. sound too excited. <laughs> Maybe they're not awake yet. Four o'clock in the morning. The guys are in the process of setting the balloon up. Here is the basket right here. The burner is now being installed on the basket. They tied the basket off to the van, so that way, while they're setting up, putting the heat to it, it doesn't take off prematurely, he said, so that's what they're doing now. And this is what the basket looks like. It's divided into four sections. I think he said it'll be about three people in each section, so. It's a lot of work to setting this thing up, I see. And here is our captain. His name is Fozzy. Now they're going to roll it out the rest of the way. Now this fan here will start blowing air in it. As you can see the balloon is starting to inflate some. And just the length of the balloon in general, once fully in blown up, this thing is going to be huge. You know, I know, I'm really like, wow, this thing is so long. Also this morning, there are two other balloons from this company that will be going up with us. Here's the first one. There's the second one. And here's ours. It's taking shape right now. And we have takeoff. Keep an eye out for animals, you never know 
bird you might see, but you could see deer, antelope, jackrabbit, coyotes, cotton rabbits, different kinds of birds, and javelinas occasionally. If you don't know what a javelina is, it looks like a hairy little pig, but it's David, what do you think so far? I said it's mighty beautiful. It is well, a beautiful coming up here in between the Doe Mesa and the Costco and Waco Mesa, there's a housing development in here. It's called the Airy, like an Eagle's Nest Airy. Uh, yeah, the lots start out at $775,000 and go to $2 million just for the lot. Woo! the crew to pick us up after we land mm -hmm. and pack it all back up and put it back in the trailer. Come on, Forrest, run. Run, Forrest, run. <laughs> run. <laughs> yeah, start walking us towards the road, towards the van. The ride is over. And we're deflating the balloon. Well, we made it back to the ground safely. 
they're in the process of taking the balloon down and putting it back in the trailer. Did you visit the National Zoo in DC? It's all loaded back up I in there. After your balloon ride, they bring you back and they have a toast. This company goes all out to get you a table, tablecloth, at the picnic basket. They do it right. You get a glass and you can get juice or water or champagne or mimosa. And the juice that we got is orange, mango, tangerine, and it's really good. And on the front it has the red rock symbol and then on the back. It is the balloonist prayer. Mm -hmm. And lifting your glasses, now it goes, the winds have welcomed you with softness, the sun has blessed you with its warm hands. You have flown so high and so well that God has joined you in your laughter and gently set you back into the loving arms of Mother Earth. Cheers. 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 Thank you for flying with us today. Wow, that was absolutely amazing. It was. Being up there and looking down at all these red rock formations, it was just absolutely beautiful. Such a peaceful ride. We, the wind wasn't bad at all today. I very much enjoyed it myself. This is the first time I've ever been in a, in a hot air balloon. How about you? This is your first time too, right? It's my first time. And I just want to say that it was so peaceful and I was so relaxed. And at no point was I uncomfortable or uneasy. You know how like when you fly and you hit a little bit of turbulence, you have that like uneasy feeling? Right. Never once had it in the hot air balloon. Just felt as safe. It and almost calm. felt like you were standing on just solid ground. It was so smooth. It, it was just very smooth, just relaxing actually, just so peaceful. And I would highly recommend this company. They were very professional. And just the experience of riding in a hot air balloon, I know it was on a lot of people's bucket list. I definitely encourage you to do it. I mean, there was no fear to it at all. And we had a perfect day for it. Just like you said about the company, highly recommend them good company to deal with they uh, sent us a message yesterday afternoon letting us know exactly what time to be there the location to meet them at so they stayed in contact just like he said they would mm -hmm. our um, balloonist Fonzie Fonzie, Fonzie. Fonzie. I, mean, I, well, I keep on wanting to say Fonzie but Fonzie mm -hmm. very nice um, funny man he was telling jokes along the way made it an enjoyable experience such an experienced balloonist as well you could tell he had a lot of experience with how did you enjoy it Carly I absolutely loved it well that's good I'm glad you had a great time because this was kind of a reward for you for finishing elementary school anyway um, so that's one of the reasons we went ahead and did it. we always try to do something big for at the end of school here especially when she finishes the school so if you don't have anything else to say why don't we go ahead and close this thing out Carly Make sure to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss all these videos. See you next time. Thank you for watching. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye.